Lego blocks are among the most popular toys in the world, and they've become a medium for fine art, too. A show titled The Art of the Brick opened recently in Times Square here in New York, and the artist took Andrea Lucia on a guided tour. How do you do what you do? Well, I do it one brick at a time. Nathan Sawaya started playing with Legos when he was five years old. He never quit. He made these sculptures, every piece of them, with his favorite childhood toy. Why not mature into another art form? It's interesting. You say mature into another art form. Um, I think I have found my passion. I've sculpted out of clay. I've sculpted out of wire. I choose to use this toy to make my art accessible so that more and more people can actually appreciate the art world and really enter into the art world that might never, ever do so. Sawaya holds exhibitions around the world. This one in New York City is his biggest ever. It was here nine years ago he left a job in corporate law. There were some friends who thought I was making a huge mistake mm -hmm. and thought, you know, you're giving up a six-figure salary to go play with toys? That was tough at first because I had gallery doors slammed in my face. You know, galleries were kind of like, uh-huh, yeah, good luck with your little Lego art. Look at this, he even has a little orange one right there. It looks like it fits in so perfectly. How do kids react to your work? Kids are a big part of what I do because I create art to inspire. Oh my God! Soweya has tackled the Mona Lisa, the Venus de Milo, American Gothic. This piece I almost missed up here. <laughs> even the ceiling of the Sistine Chapel. Is it intimidating to take on things that are so familiar to people and some of the work of great artists? Yeah, part of the, the nervousness I have for this exhibition is how people are gonna react to, to seeing works that are so iconic. I hope they see that I'm trying to be as respectful as possible. It's his original pieces, though, that play with the mind, swimming in a sea of Legos or ripping open their chests. How do you get the heart to suspend right there? That's all done through Lego magic. <laughs> okay. So creativity is contagious. His exhibit includes the work of artists he's inspired. This model of the Empire State Building came from a six-year-old. Finger paint with your kids. Maybe snap a few Lego bricks together. It'll make you happier. It will make you just a better person. A lesson he has built his life on, one brick at a time. Andrea Lucia for CBS This Morning, Saturday.